friends, welcome back to another video tutorial in Revit Architecture. I am architect Sonorai from Glad Studio and today I am going to discuss about how you can write this kind of 3D text in your vertical planes like walls and horizontal planes like floors. So for this, uh, first you are required to define a work plane. Uh, can understand this. If, suppose if you want to write this 3D text on your horizontal plane, first you are required to select this horizontal plane that you can confirm by going to this work plane settings and you can uh, set this to horizontal plane by default uh, it is in horizontal plane only you can select this pick a plane and now if you want to write on this floor you can select this horizontal plane so for confirming that uh, whether it is applied in a horizontal plane you can turn this so work plane and you can directly confirm that this is in horizontal plane only now we are ready to write our 3d text in horizontal plane so i am going to architecture tab and now i am going to select this model text this we can use for writing 3d text so you can rename this from here edit text so i am going to write restaurant here restaurant and now we will click ok and you can put it anywhere so I'm going to put on this horizontal plan and you can uh, do some more settings I will uh, tell you later now I am going to make it on horizontal plane so for this you are required to define this uh, vertical plane here you are required to set it from here work plane I'm going to set and you will uh, use this pickup plane and now I am going to select this parapet wall and now this is all set this is in our vertical plane mode now we can write through, uh, our text here so I am going to model text and I can rename this to city cafe view and you can easily place it here on vertical plane so uh, you can do some more settings by going to this work plane uh, mode if you want to write in horizontal plane you can select it from here set it and you can click your pick a plane and you can easily work in horizontal plane and vertical plane so we'll uh, discuss some more settings i'm going to select this city cafe view and now i'm going to properties tab and you can change your text font and sizes by going to this edit type and can create duplicate of this so that you cannot apply to other text font also so i'm going to uh, rename this as vertical wall font and you can change the text font size from arial to any other things like i am going to select uh, real rounded empty bolt and can change the text size from here if you want to reduce the size i'm going to make it one fit and if you want in italic or bold you can select this from here so i'm going to click ok and now you can easily see this uh, text size is reduced and font also and if you want to write in italic you can go to this edit type and can check this box here and apply and it is now you can see this is in italic font and you can do some more settings like materials and all by going to this properties tab and we'll go to this material finishes if you want to change the material you can select from here i'm going to create a new material then we'll go to this asset browser and i'm going to apply a metal band here so we'll type here search band and uh, i'm going to give this metallic band finish so i'm going to select this uh, yellow one here and we'll double click it will be applied to our this asset browser now we'll apply this material and you can see this material is changed so uh, i have applied material in our text font now we'll apply material on this horizontal plane also you can similarly follow this you can go to properties in material you can create new material here and you can select paint 
and I am going to select again another like green. We will apply this from here. Okay. And you can see this material is applied to our horizontal text. So uh, likewise you can uh, change this depth uh, of this text. So I am going to select this city cafe view and will come down here dimension depth. So 6 inch by default it is 6 inches and we can reduce it to 2 inches or whatever your uh, wish you can make it text uh, depth by selecting this here depth. So now I have uh, created this 2 inch text here. Likewise, similarly, you can reduce the text depth from here. For gentle text, you can make it. Suppose I want to make it one inch, you can just write one inch apply. So you can, uh, it is gone beyond our plane. So we'll make it three inch. So you can see this text is applied on this floor, and this is text is applied on vertical plane like, uh, like parapet wall so it is very easy to use in Revit. In the next video tutorial we will discuss some more tutorials in Revit architecture so please like share and subscribe my channel. Thanks.